So it's pretty obvious that GTA 6 is one of the most anticipated games of the year as well as all time in my opinion. It's a safe bet that GTA 6 will make Rockstar Games a boatload of money. And we finally have some news on the game's reveal trailer date. Rockstar made the announcement yesterday with a post on all social media channels and accounts stating that a new trailer will be coming on December 5th, on Tuesday. By the way, of all the times of the actual trailer dropping will be on screen right now for all your different time zones, as well as in the description and the pinned comment as well, so if you want to check out when the trailer is dropping in your country, here you go. So what can we expect? Well, GTA 6 is pretty much confirmed to be taking place in Vice City, based on Miami in real life. So we'll probably see sun-soaked vistas, beaches, and maybe even a look at our brand new playable characters, Lucia and Jason. We'll probably see shots of Vice City with police chases, gangs, crime, clubs, dancing, and maybe even characters in cars, planes, and bikes sort of just driving around. By the way, the GTA 6 trailer reveal date is now officially the new most liked gaming tweet of all time, sitting at a whopping 1.6 million likes as of recording this video. But I also wanted to talk about what I wanted to see from GTA 6's trailer myself. Now obviously we've seen some gameplay already of GTA 6 as we have had loads of leaked gameplay throughout 2023 and 2022. By the way I'm not going to show any of the leaked gameplay in this video as it would most likely be taken down by Rockstar. But the main thing I'd like to see from this new trailer is some gameplay footage. It doesn't have to be fully sort of in-game with the HUD and the UI and everything, but just some gameplay of us driving around and how the shooting mechanics are going to work and maybe some of the weird and wacky stuff that we are going to look forward to in the next game. Personally, I loved how GTA 5 leaned into the more weird and wonderful stuff with yoga, tennis, hallucinations, UFOs and the random encounters you can have with NPCs. Heck, I'd even love to go bowling again. But the main change I'd like to see would be to the shooting mechanics. The shooting mechanics in GTA games have remained very similar for a while now, so I'd like to see some quality of life improvements and maybe even some teasers at how the new game will be tweaked going forward. Personally, I'd also like to see some changes to GTA Online. Now, personally, I'm more of a single player person. I did sort of dabble in GTA Online when it came out and then when it came out again on next gen, or, which at the time obviously was PS4 and Xbox One. But for me personally, I'm not a big GTA Online person. So I'd love to see some changes to GTA Online to sort of make it more, you know, appealing for people like me who only really dip into the single player and the story mode. But personally, I think this new trailer on Tuesday will be more of a reveal of the title itself as well as Vice City, with maybe even a second trailer or a longer extended cut version of the trailer shown off at the Game Awards on the following December 7th, two days after the actual reveal trailer for GTA 6. So tell me in the comments below, what do you want to see from GTA 6 and do you think it will be Rockstar's best game yet? Thank you so much for watching and for more Rockstar and GTA and gaming content overall, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye.